Facts First presents. Neighbors thought that a woman was crazy for putting Irish Spring soap in her yard until they figured out why. Many people plant gardens in their yards in the springtime. There's nothing better than going out to your yard to pick fresh vegetables from your garden to put in a salad. All gardens look different depending on the types of vegetables you're growing. One woman had planted a garden, but it looked nothing like any garden you've ever seen. Neighbors thought this woman was crazy for putting Irish Spring soap in her front yard. When they figured out why she was doing it, though, they realized this woman was actually a genius. Planting a garden takes a lot of work. You need to dig up the old soil and replace it with fertilized soil. Next, you need to dig holes for your plants and fill those holes with fresh dirt. When the garden's planted, you need to take care of it every day. The plants need to be watered either before the sun comes up or after the sun goes down. If you water the plants during the hottest time of the day, it can burn the leaves. You also need to use plant food on a regular basis if you're going to grow properly. Unfortunately, regardless of all the hard work you put into planting and caring for your garden, it can still be destroyed overnight. Deer, rabbits, groundhogs, various other pests and critters will use your garden as their own vegetable buffet. Some people put up fences and cages to protect their gardens. However, if a critter really wants to get inside, they will find a way. There are some people who will use poison to kill critters. Well, not only will this leave dead wildlife in your garden, it can also be dangerous for the plants. Some people use disgusting methods, such as buying coyote urine on the internet. When you spray the urine around the garden, it's supposed to keep the critters away. Not only is using animal urine gross, it also makes your yard stink. For some people, the problem seems impossible to prevent. Many people just cross their fingers and pray that the critters and insects stay away from the garden. Unfortunately, that doesn't always work either. These people just hope and pray because they don't know that the solution to their problem could be right there in their own bathroom. The solution to the problem is Original Scent Irish Spring Soap. No, oh, not kidding. Not only is it not expensive, it won't harm the critters or your plants. The reason this soap is so effective is that Irish Spring has a very strong scent. Most humans like the smell, but animals don't. If you're thinking about using Irish Spring to keep the critters away from your garden, it's pretty easy. Start by cutting a piece of the soap up into large chunks. Next, put each chunk of soap in an old sock and then tack it to a plant stake. If you put the soap around the perimeter of the yard, it'll also keep critters away. If you want added protection, you can hang the chunks of soap from your tomato cages. That'll keep the critters away from the tomatoes and all the surrounding vegetables. If you have fruit-bearing trees that you're worried about, you can use Irish Spring soap to protect your fruit as well. You can put the soap in a sock and use a string to tie it to the branches of the tree. If you're planning to use Irish Spring to protect your garden or your fruit-bearing trees, you should understand that the solution is going to last for about four weeks. When that time's up, you're going to need to remove the soap and replace it with new soap. That's because the scent of the soap will eventually start to fade. When the animals can't smell the soap, they're going to come back and try to eat your fruits and vegetables. There's no reason to poison your plants, poison animals, or make your yard stink. You also don't need to spend hundreds of dollars on special fencing to keep the animals out and protect your garden. All you need is a few bars of Irish Spring soap, which will cost you less than five bucks. It's also a great opportunity to make use of those holy socks that you have in your drawer, too. Subscribe for more.